Yeah, I have a strong relationship with my family in general. I, I'm open with them about anything. But this is recently because I was never close to my mom. See, this is what suck. I'm barely getting close to my mom when I'm about to leave. So I'm getting attached and I'm going I'm to cry my butt off when I leave. I'm motivated to be, you know, the teacher, you know, get my education there and I'm going to be back. I'm going to study early childhood education. I have a lot of baby cousins and so I'm really good with kids and I love little kids. So that's what helped me decide to become an early childhood educator. Teacher. Well, I wanted to be a teacher because, like, I believe, like, as a child, you could get them. They listen more when they're children, because that's what my mom told me as growing up. Like, when you're when you're a child, you learn more. Like with my Spanish, my Spanish sucks because my mom, my parents didn't teach me at a young age Spanish. So that's why, like, if you listen and like other, like my little cousin knows sign language because he learned it when he was a little kid, and so you have to get them, get them when they're smaller. So. The most challenging thing that I will have to go, you know, face in college is being alone. Like, you know, I, I might be busy throughout the day and independent or whatever, but at the end of the day, I come to my family, I talk to them about my day, you know. I think that's what's going to be hard the most, being, okay, I'm going to go through college, okay, I'm going to get my stuff done, work, get my education, but when I go to my dorm, I'll probably be alone sometimes. My dorm, my roommate might be out, I'm just going to be lonely. I found out about Evangel University through a magazine, and so they were giving out magazines, and I saw it through an advertisement. But I grew up in church. My my grandmother she passed away, and so she, my my grandma was a woman of God, and so I just grew up in church, and so church is kind of like my second family. I started stepping off in high school. High school messed me up. Freaking, they did man. They, they screwed me up. So anyway, sophomore and junior, I started like falling like I, I wouldn't wasn't you know all that crazy about God and then senior year I was like okay I hit rock bottom and I was like okay I need to get right with God again and so I started giving up some things and I, I feel like college that that will help me more that, that college that Christian college will help me more and get closer to God um it's important to me because I, I believe in heaven and hell uh, you know I read Bible verses um my grandma was a woman of God, and I know she would have been proud of me, you know, picking a Christian college. And, you know, everybody in my mom's side of the family, they're all Christian, so I know they're they're supporting me 100%, especially, you know, going to a Christian college. Because if it was SIU, it would have been like, really, because, you know, it's a party school. They don't wanna... My friend told me about it, I'm like, I'm like no, nah, I can't go there. Because I know my temptations, like, smoking, drinking, sex, yeah, I would have been like, all in for it, but, I know what's good for me, what's bad for me, so I chose that college where I know I'll get my education and be on a good path.